so i am running a little bit late well i'm actually like gonna be right on time but i need to hurry up so i can be on time um but i wanted to intro the vlog we are doing a vacay prep vlog first up is the waxes i'm on my way now to get my brazilian wax and my underarm wax we are going to be doing lashes brows um what else we basically prepping for vacation so let's hit the road So I just got out of the wax place. I'm pretty sad because my hairs under my arms were not long enough to wax. So she tried, but literally nothing came off because they're too short. But it's like, I'm just annoyed because now I'm gonna have to shave and I hate to do that. But last weekend for my birthday stuff, I shaved when I knew that I shouldn't have and wasn't supposed to because I was getting a wax this week but I was like I cannot I can't be out turning up lifting up my arms and stuff with the with the with the stuff okay but now I'm having to pay for it because my hairs are not long enough for me to get my underarms waxed so now I'm gonna have to shave them and I like I said I just hate that but Brazilian is done um I forgot to say nails and stuff too are happening in this vlog but right now, I need to, for one, go home to pee because I have to pee. Um, and I don't feel like going back in there. Just be like, uh, can I pee real quick? Um, and I also need to go to run some errands real quick. I need to go to Dollar Tree. I need to go to the mall. I need to go to Walmart. I need to go to the beauty supply store. So I got to run like a bunch of errands. But we will pick back up with all of the uh, vacay prep stuff tomorrow okay hey y'all it is the following day and we are about to head to get nails and petty and then when we come back we are gonna tint our brows and do our lash extensions like i told y'all i couldn't get my underarms waxed so i have so many reminders set in my phone to remind myself to like shave right like literally the morning that we leave um, just so that I don't have to worry about it while on vacation. But right now, I need to transfer my bag. Flighting is bad, but, you know, just go with me. So, we're about to head to the nail salon. Like I said, I'm going to need... I'm wearing my um, Coach Pillow Tabby bag. This bag is my birthday gift to myself. I bought this for myself for my birthday. I bought it early because I didn't want to risk it selling out, um, but I didn't open it until the other day as it was like getting closer to my birthday. But I was like, I need to make sure that there's nothing like wrong with the bag. I'm trying to like wait it out. And it's like, girl, no, you need to check the bag to make sure it don't need to be returned. Um, So y'all need my headphones, chapstick, card holder. And I think that's it. I'm just going for the nose line. Oh crap. Let me take my probiotic. That's what I need to do. So take my probiotic and my vitamins. So I'm just going to put my car holder in here. These, uh, this case is pretty like bulky, but it'll fit my chapstick. And then I'm probably going to throw my car keys in here. Just have, um, my uniform on. <laughs> <laughs> like I feel like this is low key my uniform any kind of two piece set with like this kind of shirt I got a white one I got this kind of one I will just run to it because it's so quick and easy but anyway so I got my stuff now let's head out um am I forgetting something no I have my car holder I have my chapstick I have my earbuds and that's it Y'all, I did like this little like crochet style for vacation, which I never do. And I low-key am feeling very nervous and anxious and low-key feeling like I'm going to regret it because it's just too much hair. I plan to wear it like this when I get in the water anyway, but like, I don't know. I don't do this. I normally braid my hair or do twists or forelocks or something. But I was like, let me try something different. And it was quick. And I just wasn't in the mood to like do no braids or anything like that. But 
so far I'm getting a little nervous because like this hair is too much and the pe the crochet knots are like becoming undone. So it's like, is pieces of my hair gonna just be falling out all throughout the vacation? I don't know. Anyway, let's go. Else so I didn't really get much footage because for one she was using my phone to like look at the picture to do, to do the design and then also too I feel like y'all have seen me go to the nail salon a zillion times like it's like how many times can you can you watch somebody go to the nail salon right but this is what the nails are looking like I feel like you can't really see it that good a little something something of course with my colors because I just love these colors they make me happy that's all. And you already know, I'm basic. I got white on the toes. The heart want what it want, bitch. <laughs> yeah, now I'm about to head home and we're going to do these lashes and tint these brows. First, I need to get me something to eat, though. I'm hungry, okay? I have no clue what I'm going to get to eat, but I need to eat something. It is 6.07 and I haven't eaten one thing today. Not one thing. So, I need to eat. Okay, so I feel like on camera, it's, it's not giving what it supposed to have gave, but in person, it looks really nice, and I really like it. But I did want eye off camera because I never used this lash glue. I never used these lashes before, so I needed to test it out and try it out before I get on camera talking about this what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, I got some 10s and 12s, 10s and 12s, and then 14s in the um center i really i don't know i'm feeling like maybe i should have got like a longer length but this is my setup so i have i use these lashes this little kit i got it from amazon i'll link it down below if y'all interested but um i'm using the 14s and the 12s and the 10s and I was trying to see which glue was better. So I used a little bit of hair glue. And then I used some of this glue right here just to see like, you know, which one performed better or which one I liked better. And at first I was liking the hair glue better because that's just my norm and what I'm used to using. But I actually like this glue better because it gets very sticky and tacky. And I feel like the lashes will stay in place. It's kind of, it's going to be, I feel like hard for me to like, record this because i need to get the mirror up close to my eye but i showed you my setup so this is the little technique that i'm doing right i'm taking a tin which i really feel like the tins is a little too short but i didn't realize that until i had already put them on my eye so we just gonna do the same thing so everything looks the same so i'm gonna take some of the glue and then dab it on hello somebody whatever so i'm gonna take some glue and then i'm gonna put like markers so i'm gonna put one at the end and i'm putting it under uh -oh. girl And then we're going to take a 14 and put it in the center.
Okay, so these are like my points. So I have the, the a lash right here, a lash right here, and a lash right here. Then I'm just gonna literally fill in, obviously putting the 14s around the 14, putting, I'm gonna put 12s around the 10, and then 12s around the 10 on this side, because I wanted it to be like shorter, sh ouch. Shorter, shorter, and then longer, kind of like in the center. that I just did on camera look better than this eye but they both look cute and I don't know why I wasn't been doing the whole like when I do lash extensions for vacation because I always do my own I don't know why I didn't always do like the go under thing because it really does look so nice all right lashes is done now I could eat I'm hungry I still didn't eat yet. Rob went to go get me some Chipotle though. I'm about to go eat that junk on the rooftop and enjoy the last bit of sun. And I forgot to say, I'm gonna do my brow tint when um like when I'm packing. Cause I like to let it sit for a very long time so it could really, really take. So I like to let that junk sit for like an hour and some change. So while I'm packing, I'll do like the brow tint before I start packing, but while I'm packing, I wanna like have the brow tint on. I'm very nervous about this hair. It's already feeling like it's messing up and I haven't even got on the plane yet. As far as like just it feeling tangly and like, you know, but it's cute though, but it's just like, I don't know if I should have got this, like going somewhere for five days, but there's my food. So this angle is, you know, it is what it is. But I'm about to use this just for men. This is what I usually tint my brows with when I tint them myself. I use this, like I told y'all, I like to let this stay on for a very, very, very long time. So I'm about to just mix this up. And then I'm still in a technique from when I get my brows professionally tinted. We're like using the white to like outline. Um, and I already have brows on, but I'm just going to like outline and then so that way I, you know, go inside of the lines and whatever, whatever. I'm using um, an angle brush to apply and yeah, I'm going to mix first and then I'm going to outline the brows. All right. So you just put like an equal amount of both in the thing. Um, so this is the color base and then you put that a dab of do ya and then you put the color developer a dab of do ya and I'm gonna put these back in the box these like last a very long time as far as like the amount that you use you really need a little bit so then i'm going to use the little thing that they put in here to mix it up okay so that is what it's looking like after it's mixed up then i'm gonna start trying to outline my brows i need the mirror
crazy, but just go with me on this. Now, I'm going to take my angle brush and get some product on here. Once it starts to take, you can see like it starts to get darker. So you can see where you have the the color at and then go in and like add what you need to add or take off what you need to take off before it starts to like completely set. Okay, so like I said, I like to let this sit for a long time. It doesn't look like nothing is on my brows, but it is. So I'm going to let this sit for like an hour. All right, it's about that time. I'm gonna see. I honestly wasn't keeping track of the time, to tell you the truth. But I wiped off the head just so it wasn't like super, super, super harsh. Uh oh, I think I took it off too soon. Too soon. Yeah, I think I took it off too, too soon. Too, too soon. Too, too soon. I should have been keeping track of the time. I honestly have no remembrance of what time it was. I'm going to double back and put a second layer on. Cause this is definitely not dark enough and it's not going to last. The brows are definitely not as dark as I want them to be. So I'm going to go in and do another layer. But if I don't get a chance to close out this video, I'm going to close it out now. Thank you for watching, girl. I was trying to do my best to record all of this stuff, but I'm also having to actually do it in real time and get ready for like vacation. So... I don't know how the video is going to come out, but I tried, okay? I did what I could do. So, you get a video. A thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.